Do you actually lose half of your body heat through your head? When I was younger and I used to go out to play during the winter, my mum always used to tell me to make sure I was wearing my woolly hat. She did this, I'm sure, to keep my ears warm, but I'm pretty sure as well she probably believed that misconception that you lose almost half your body heat through your head. And I have heard this many, many times before, but the question is, how true is it? It turns out not very true at all. A 2008 study figured out that for adults, we only lose about 10% of our body heat through our heads. Now that seems all too easy, doesn't it? But it is true. You can shed heat from any part of the body that exposed to the elements, and not one part of your body sheds significantly more heat than another. So where does this myth come from then? Well, in 1970, the US Army Survival Manual strongly recommended covering your head when it's cold because you lose 40 to 45% of your body heat through your head. But where did that belief come from? Well, in 1950, a scientific experiment by the US military dressed volunteers in Arctic survival suits, and they were then exposed to bitterly cold conditions. And because it was the only part of their body that was uncovered, obviously their head lost the most amount of heat. So there we go, next time someone says you lose almost half your body heat through your head, you can say no, it's more like 10%. I've been Simon Dan, this has been another Misconception Mini, and I'll see you next time. Yeah, I'm in the garden. Subscribe here. That's the subscribe button. More videos, more videos. Enjoy.